We are going to go ahead and do a little bit of work on isometric and multi-view drawing with this particular shape. So if you need to just compare it to your drawing, go ahead and stop the video right now and just compare. If you need to see it step by step, go ahead and watch the rest of the video. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to begin with my point of origin, which I'm going to put right there. Uh, this object is five units wide. So I have my initial line, then it's three units tall. Well, this feature is three units, I should say. Then it's three units wide. Then just down from there. Okay, now next I'm going to go from here back. So it is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Draw it right there. It is five high. One, two, three, four, five. Five high right there. Uh, three wide at the top. Just like so. Then five wide. I'm going to run over my drawing just a bit. I hope you don't mind. Then three units here. Close the top shape. Uh, let's see. Now next, this feature is three by three. going to connect there and let's see I'm going to connect there and then we will connect there so that is the shape in isometric now we need to do multi view Multi-view, I'm going to start with my point of origin, which will be that back corner. And I am going to locate the point of origin right about there. Now this object looks to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 wide. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 wide. That is my baseline. It is five tall. One, two, three, four, five tall. Three wide. Then let's see. Those connect. Then three by three. Very easy view. Just like that using very light construction lines transfer up all the features just like so and I'm going to start here we have a nice solid face line just like that and it is one two three four five wide and we have a nice solid back line. Let's darken up our object lines a little bit. This feature is carried around across, so we're going to darken that up. Uh, now next we have this feature, which is just a 3x3. Three three. Dark object line, dark object line and now erase all the lines that don't belong there <laughs> okay now next we have the front view 
So just like we have been, carry over all the feature lines. If you like construction lines, make sure that they don't touch the object line. It makes it difficult to erase. Uh, we have a nice solid line on our right hand side. The object is one, two, three, four, five wide, just like so. And then we have our three by three feature. Erase the lines that don't belong there. <coughs> Erase our construction lines. And there you have it. Um, let me darken up this object line just a bit. Okay, go ahead and stop this video, rewind and replay as many times as you need in order to get the concept.